Hi, hello, and hopefully the audio is recording because this would be bad if it isn't. But, um, I. Uh, something's going wrong. Wait. Oh, oh, it's not. I mean, it's not working as I want it to, but. Oh, oh there we go. Alright, we got. I hope you can hear me because we're gonna explain Kerbal Space Program and all its components and everything. If you look at my channel, you haven't seen much space things, but I'm gonna get more into space and stuff. I got a new book about um, Apollo 13. Um, I'm not gonna get too much into that, but we're not gonna. I have sort of like a cold right now, so that's why my voice sounds like I drawn cheese graters. So, um, I'm gonna go real quick. Right, so we're about to start with a new rocket I found. Um. Yeah, so I don't have any mods, just saying, so. I'm gonna zoom this sandbox mode. <laughs> um. So we're gonna go to the launch pad and it pops up with all of these. So we're gonna. Um, this is the one I was gonna do, but I think I should do a different one. Kobo X. I'm gonna try this one. This one is made by the game. So, if you don't know what this game is, it's pretty much you make rockets and then pretty much blast them into space and go to different planets if you want to, or just orbit um, the Earth or Kobo. This will go Kobin. <laughs> so, you press Z if you want to put the throttle all the way up, X if you want to put it all the way down, Sh left shift to go all the way up, slowly, or not just, um, and control to slowly go down. So I like putting it right here, and then they all go off, and then you pump it fully, I go home. So we have stability assist on the SAS and OCS, which is pretty much. Do I have some on here? I hope I do. Just so I can. No, I have a lot of things. First. Landing strut. Oh, I have landing struts. That's nice. I've never flown this, so we're gonna see how I get there. It has a parachute on top. You can also put parachutes on the side. And if on this flight we have, oh, it doesn't say their name. It just says scientist and pilot. Oh, before we're saying their names. Um, but you can press this button, and if you look at the the capsule, um, you'll see them sitting in there. Very interesting. We're still going up, and we just find another fuel in those two engines. So we're gonna separate both of them. They're gonna probably crash into each other on the way down. Or they're gonna smash against the ground and burn. So, either two, I don't wanna do with this capsule. So, alright, so we got those two done. Those two fall. Now we have this one going. So, pretty much you'll get into space. So, there's a solution maybe here. Oh, that's perfect, isn't it? There's no separate. Oh. oh, there is. There's an engine on it there. Huh. Strange. Um, yeah, so as you get up there, you press space to um, ignition. So, and once we get up, 
Um, I'm gonna say 30,000 feet. I'm gonna cut the engine and turn. Oh, yeah, we do have um, OCS. This gauge. You see, so now we have two engines. And we're gonna come back down to Earth. If we so then we can separate the but we can do that, then we can time warp. So pretty much what we're doing is we're going up here and then coming right back down. And upon re entry I need to point a heat shield, which is this little thing on the bottom, towards the earth, or we're gonna burn, which we don't want. So we're going, we're going, we're going. It would take me four minutes to actually get down to here. If you look up here, it has days and years. It, it, you, you won't spend years on this game, but when you will tell you how long you, it would take to get to places if you don't speed it up. So it could take you. So we're about to re-enter, and it's probably gonna, ain't gonna happen here. Oh, maybe we already burned up, and we'll come back or something. Yeah. Oh, we survived anyways, so. Was a boom. Oh, I don't know the elevation. Oh, this is bad. Because if I hit the parachute too early, then I'm gonna have a slow drift down. But if I hit it too away, we're gonna hit four thousand miles per hour. I think once we get down to exactly two thousand, yeah. Parachute. Here we go. I'm sorry I'm not talking much. Just go four times just to get it done quicker. You can see them down here. So let's go in the view just to see what they see. That explosion, don't worry, that was not the space probe. That, well, that was not the capsule, that was the um, parachute. So, that's pretty much what I do each time. And you can do all sorts of things with it. Oh no, that was the heat shield. See, so you would do and it's on or something. You can see the lights turn on and you can turn them off. You can transfer crew to something. What is three in here? Well, if we look at the view, we can see that. One and three and three. Oh, jeez, I'm freaking out. <laughs> okay. So then we can revert flight. Oh, put it on the space center. So, this one, I've been wanting to try because it says orbiter, which I want to see if it would orbit. Alright, ready, ignition. Oof, that, that's a fail. There's a capsule down there. Wait, let's, let's see, can I just decouple? Boy, you can do things. And let's see. 
Alright. So how about we make our own one this time? So we go to vehicles on the way, but we gotta clear it. So pretty much what I usually do is I'll grab this one, but let's change it up a bit. Let's do this one. And no. Um let's switch the editor because I like space ones better. Can't switch it. Switch editor. So now we're in the space point hanger. Um got this one, this one, and this one and this. If I get this I can combine it with that, but if I get this I can I'm gonna go with this. Just gonna grab this and put it on the front there. So we have that. Now we're gonna put some engines on here. So yeah, we're gonna have that. And then we're gonna grab. I like these engines. They create. It's pretty much four in one. So. And we're gonna pick this. We're gonna pick the tail first. There we go. And now, my favorite ones are these, but I think that, yeah, a little big. So, how about. So, you can click down here and you can get symmetry on the wings and everything. Oh, those are too small. Oh jeez, alright, we'll pick those because those are cool. Um, you know, it doesn't have to look cool, it just, just as long as it flies, it doesn't explode as soon as it touches the runway. So, if you haven't known, I've actually flown a plane in real life. Um, I expect most of you are my friends. So you would already know this. Um, go check out um um Quim Luna's channel. He, he he's one of the, uh, he's a friend of mine and everything. I'm gonna give him a shout out right now. And if you're watching this, then he gives a shout out. Um, I really hope I can. I'm gonna be able to post this though. Um, hopefully the audio is good so I can. Do this, but and yeah, I can't figure out these, so we're just gonna wing it. I'm sorry, um, I had to. Let's see if these are these can these work as wings. Oh, yeah, they do. Ooh, I like these, these are way better. Alright, so we're gonna have to pull it hate in the comments from making that joke. Oh jeez. I can see it now. <laughs> so tell me in the comments how your two week weekend is going because mine's going just fine with a cold. Ugh. Pretty much. There we go. And then we need to double this so I can get double this, double that, double, double this, that. I'm sorry. I guess that wasn't. Oh, I'm not gonna make that joke. That's gonna kill my subscribers. Like dead. Boom. Done. OIP Andrew Buck's channel. Jeez.
There. That should. No, the wheels are in. There. But those look better than on the wings. And we're gonna put an airbag on the top just in case, you know. No, just in case we need it. Ever. So I forget what is it's in. Pretty sure it's in science. Nope, utility. So now it's up here somewhere. No, no, no. Oh, I just saw it. Right. Airbags. So if we need to slow down, these little things to do it. Alright, let's go on trip. So this is take one pretty much of this space plane. Hopefully, yeah, oh, there's one curve in there, right? That's good. So, oof. Oh, that's why we need them on the sides. Right, I'm not even gonna launch it. I know that thing's gonna blow up in two seconds. But again, that would be entertaining to see. Well, we're gonna probably see this thing explode in two seconds. Um. Huh. Does anybody else have this problem? I swear, oh god. Alright. I don't even know what's happening anymore with this. Alright, um, we just need to turn it the other way. There. There we go. Oh, I know what's happening. It's because these need to be circular. Be. Yeah, I keep on putting them on. Maybe go on the wings. There we go. This should work fine now. Oh, the engine doesn't just cut out on me. Sometimes it does that and it sucks. <laughs> so. so, as you can see, oof. Oof, why is it doing this? Are they uneven or something? This is not good. Alright, let's try it. No, we're doing good. Let's get first person. Nice, nice. Alright. It's doing better than I expected. Lift off sucks. We are going down. Mayday, mayday, mayday. Oh god. Alright, Eevee, Eevee. Ooh. We lived. How? There must be one heck of a thing just happened. Give all the controls and everything. How'd you live? <laughs> Alright, um, let's not do that. How about we go to space station we actually get a cool thing going. Besides my crappy designs. We've built so many space shuttles and they all fail. Um, alright, let's see. So we got this, 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 this. So we're just gonna be a long time. Um, my favorite one to do, ooh, this one, this thing. The Malwood. Ooh. I'll probably leave going in the channel in the description. I may. Um. Or if not, I'll just put it in the comments. But yeah. This one's cool, called the X-Wing. Which, if you watch Star Wars, you'll know that. This thing is insane, though. More white speed, I can white speed, jeez. I, I like these engines, they were cool. And they thrust all those wings, the blue wings. Yeah, so, right now I'm a little mad because my Civil Air Patrol meeting got cancelled and I was gonna get promoted, so, yeah, this works. Um, you know, just for my channel to not get um, hit by Copa, you know, uh, yeah. well, I'm gonna say stuff like fuck. Yeah. yeah. <sighs> yes, okay, we finally got it. Damn. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. Yeah. 
There we go. No, now we're moving fast. I'm gonna break the sound barrier in a little bit. Look at that. Look at my sound barrier. So, I'll be making videos in the future. But, wait, look, look at this. Boom, 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 boom. Cut the engines. Yeah. It's still moving. Like, oh, 200 meters per second. That means, think of a meter. I'm traveling 200 of those per second. It's insane. <laughs> it is. So it feels old. Why would I? Oh god. Now we're talking. And just because I'm gonna crash it and then end this video, so. What is it? Yeah, G Force killing my powers right now, so. Mm -hmm. A little RCS if I have it. I don't have RCS, but we have SAS. Let's do that. Retrograde. Stability assist. Yeah, we're definitely gonna crash this thing. Let's see if we can control crash it though. Let's see if we can land it. Ain't gonna happen though. <laughs> I'm, I'm telling you guys that right now. I am not gonna land this thing. And if I do, better praise me in the comments because I've never landed a thing in Cobra Space Program. So, <laughs> gear down. Alright, let me gear down. I'm shutting down all the engines. Yeah, so we're gonna... Alright, this one's actually way easier to control than most of the things. Oh my god, what is... You may actually see my first landing in Cobra Space Program. We're gonna start. Nope, may happen. Yeah, we're gonna crash. Mayday, mayday. Oh no, we're falling into the ocean. Well. <sighs> Kerbins, see your death view. Um, did all Kerbins survive? He survived. No way. Okay. Um, I guess we're gonna end the video there because my computer is freaking out. So, see you in a little bit, and well, ne next time, and goodbye.